If you're really a closet Woody Allen or a closet Barbara Streisand, Robin Carter tells us tonight about a new club in Miami where you can take center stage. It's called the box office and they might be looking for you. William Rosenstein is a police officer on Miami Beach, but deep in his heart, he is really a stand-up comedian who goes by the name of Billy Swan. I just got back from Las Vegas where I was working at the International House of Pancakes. and uh, Billy Swan is one of a half dozen would-be performers who auditioned today for a chance at stardom at the box office. That's a new comedy variety club at the Omni Hotel, which when it opens in October, will showcase local talent. What happens if your career really takes off now? Are you going to turn in your badge? I don't think so. I uh, I do this as a sideline. It's a it's a hobby. I enjoy it, and uh, it's a thrill to get up there and perform. But and most of the people who auditioned here today were ordinary folks like you and me who are aspiring stars in their spare time. Take Lawrence Lester for example. When he's not a magician, he's a statistics and epidemiology professor at FIU. He's also hoping the box office will give him a spot in the spotlight. And so is the singing group Prime. Love lift us up where we belong, where the eagles fly on a mountain high. The group consists of a Broward County English teacher and two computer specialists. They practice their harmony after hours, but they're hoping the box office might give them a shot at a whole new career. I think it's wonderful because the type of club this is is the level that we wanted to start at. And as singers, you know, this would be a good place to start. Club manager Alan Leeds has been canvassing bars and nightclubs for the past three months looking for the singers, comedians, and jugglers who may be hidden in South Florida. I'm looking for not the shoe salesman who's always wanted to sing all his life. I'm looking for the singer because there's no way to perform in Miami has become a shoe salesman. Okay, so what happens if you do get picked to perform? Well, you get 20 minutes in the spotlight, a chance at exposure, but no pay. It's going to operate similar to places like Catch a Rising Star in New York in the comic strip in Fort Lauderdale, except the box office will feature local amateur talent at least four nights a week. Hmm. How about all those people who are just hearing about this place? Uh, this There's evening? still a chance. They're going to be looking for talent on a continual basis, and all someone has to do is contact the Omni Hotel and ask for the box office. Go okay. down and try out. And hey, we can do an act, I think. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for us at 